I don't know. Adobe. 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 Don't do this now. Nah. Adobe. 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 Wake up. What is it now? Adobe is dead. <laughs> what are you saying? Adobe. She cannot be dead. Adobe. She is dead. What happened to her? I don't know. I went to the bush. She's myself. I'm coming out of someone like this. Adobe. 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 Seen somebody invisible there with copper uniform smiling at you. Who is smiling at you? There is nobody there. I, I know what I'm saying. I saw something over there. See, I beg. I am hungry. Just start cooking. Let me eat. I beg. Copper. Copper. Adaku. Who is after you? On my way back from school, I saw the dead body of Adobe. You mean Adobe in my class? Yes, Adobe in class. How? What happened? They don't know. Don't know. Um, what of her parents? Has her parents been informed? Yes, yes. Her mother, she's on her way there now. Yes. What is this now? Something is wrong somewhere. <laughs> My name is Ikuku. 
I am the custodian of the tradition of Omudim. We don't have a king. Eh? And uh, this is my son. And uh, I will say once again, you are welcome. Uh, Thank you very much, sir. Thank you so much for the introduction of mine. Yeah. Mm, my name is Abigail, and here is my co copper. Yeah. My name is Richard, sir. Hey, Richard, yeah. Once again, you are welcome. Uh, in case you have any need of anything, ask my son. He will provide it to you. Yeah? Yes. Yeah? Yes. And. Uh, the last couple that kid ran away. We didn't know the reason why she ran away. Please, don't run away. Eh? Help to educate our children. Eh? Of course not. We cannot run away. Yeah, it yeah. is our duty to serve our father's land, no, and that no, is what no. we are here to do. No, no, no. Exactly, sir. No, no, no. Let me. Let's go. Let's let's go. Uh, uh, follow back. Eh? Follow back. Hey, come on. Yes. How much are you going to pay or try and get water? Okay. How much do you want? 100 naira for each gallon. Ah, uh, uh, no. It's too much. How can we be paying 100 naira for each gallon? Okay. We'll give you 15 naira for each. Yes. Let's go and I thought this is a local village. They even know the value of money. Imagine! How can we be paying 100 naira for each gallon? How much do we now fetch water in on each I think we'll talk to Ikuku about it. Because I don't know how long we'll keep paying 15 for one gallon of water. Sorry. It's too much, I beg. No. We can't talk to Ramon. We have to talk to him. 100 naira. For how much allow we? 15.5. Let's never even see food job. Now uh -uh. to pay 15 naira for one gallon of water. Hi. Let me even see if we talk long show, sir. See. Just imagine. Empty bar. No, I'll talk to him about it. Oh.
ಈ ಬೈಟಿ You're not dressed. How about now? You know we are late. Go and dress up so we can leave. I will soon be ready. But something troubles my mind. I had a bad dream. A bad dream? What happened in the dream? In the dream, I saw myself standing near the village stream. Searching for network. Suddenly, a girl dressed in copper uniform came out from the river, smiling. And when I asked her who she was, I woke up. <coughs> hey, M. Love you, girl. Do you feel sick? Do you, do, you, do you think you have malaria or something? Are you feeling alright? You know you play a lot. <laughs> I know what I saw. Okay, see, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just go and get dressed so we can leave this place. We are late. Nothing is happening. Go and get dressed, I beg. Abigail. Okay. Get dressed in NYC. NYC don't get ghost. Next time, some will leave. I'm tired of the inconsistency. We're not even learning anything. Hey. Nkechi, you know that Mama went to meet him. I knew she comes back and meet you. She's going to beat you. Come on, come on, let's go to school. I'm not going. Come on, girl, leave you. You can go now. It's by force to follow My friend, come bring her back. Leave me before. Come bring her back. Nkechi. Nkechi, come bring her back. Leave me. Nkechi. What are you still doing at home? Mama, I told this girl to come bring her back. Let's go to school. And she says she's not going. Meaning what? Nkechi? Mama. Why won't you go to school? Mama, I'll go to school. Come on, go and get your bag and go to school. Mama, I'll bring her back, my friend. Mama, I'll bring her back. If I meet you there... My friend, let's go. Let me! I'll leave this girl alone. Let me! Let me see her. Come on, go to school. Mama, let me stop him now. He went to farm. Uh, I hope you wash the plates yes, and the pots. Yes. What about Wait the kitchen? Everything is good. Give her, let her go. Mommy, bye bye. Bye bye. to this village last week and you're already admiring him. He is here to teach and educate us, not to fall in love. Mm -hmm. And so, if he falls in love, is it a bad thing? It's not a bad thing, no, but you're below his standard now. Eh? Even if he wants to fall in love, he's not with you. He cannot... Uh, he went to the university, but you, 
You did not even finish your secondary school before giving Hi. birth in your father's house. Ujumwa, eh? are you trying to insult me or what? No, I'm not insulting you. <laughs> what about your boyfriend, Chibuzo? The son of this Emo. Mm, that one, he is good. But you cannot compare him to this handsome copa. He is so cute. Hi. I feel like having him. <laughs> May the gods forbid. Are you even listening to yourself? Did you hear what you just said? I cannot stay here and hear this abomination, please. Uh, would you want? Would you want for me now? Would you wait for me now? Obina, that reminds me. When was the last time you saw Mbweke? Because it has been a while I saw her last. I saw her yesterday at uh, Ekobu Market with her mother and the child, that's the son. And the son looks like you, the resemblance is there. Obina, hmm? what kind of stupid resemblance are you talking about? Eh? Which one is the resemblance is there? Are you the one that put resemblance there? I've told you, times without number, that child is not mine. Assume the resemblance is there. Mbeke uh, is your girlfriend. Then how come the child is not yours? Obina, at your age, you still do not know the difference between girlfriend and wife. So you don't know the difference between girlfriend and wife. You that is talking, as if you don't know Mbeke, Mbeke that gives it to people anywhere that she sees them. Mweke even gave it to me the first day I spoke to her. Mm -hmm. So who told you that I am the only one that goes to her thing? Do I look like someone that is careless enough to get a girl like Mweke pregnant? Uh, I see Mweke is my girlfriend. I'm sorry. How about the two coppers that came to our village? I heard you are the one in charge of them. Oh, that one? Yes. I was even the one that took them to their lodge the day they came. So my father told me to make sure I provide anything they need. So, they are, they are doing just fine. They are doing fine. Um, but, why did the last couple that came to our village run away without telling anybody? Here. Here! Obina, here! Here! Oh, God, you what kind of... Why are you just asking me stupid questions today? Did you drink? Mm -mm. What kind of stupid questions are this one now? Am I her father? Mm -mm. Her mother, mm -mm. her brother, mm -mm. or sister? Mm -mm. Do I live with her? Mm -mm. Do I look like her in any way? No. So why are you asking me? Hmm? I, I, I wish that these two couples that came to our village stay and teach our brothers and sisters in school. You know our village is the last village among the seven villages in Mueke. And it's very far from the city. I believe that's why the, uh, the copper ran away without telling anybody. Obina, maybe. Or maybe not. I don't know why she left. In fact, Obina, I, I need to go home before my father will look for me. You know, that man has grown very old and he needs me to assist him in almost everything that he does. So, let me go home and meet him before he... Let me follow you now. Follow me to where? To your house. To go and do what? Maybe eat now. You know now. Nah. Did you keep any food? Let's go. Let's go. Okay, nah. you, you eat too much these days. Oh, we are not.
Adobe! 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 No! Somebody help! Adobe! Let me come help me. I don't know what happened to my sister. What happened to her? I don't know! Adobe! 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 Adobe, wait for me! Adobe, don't do this now! Adobe! 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 Adobe, wake up! What are you saying? I don't She's gonna be dead. I don't be. She's dead. What happened to her? I don't know. I went to the bush with myself. I'm coming out as well like this. I don't be. I don't be. That woman can gossip. Eh? She wanted to scatter our meeting. Ha. Eh? Ana, Ana, I'm not going to Seen somebody invisible there with copper uniform smiling at you. Who is smiling at you? There is nobody there. I, I know what I'm saying. I saw standing over there. See, I beg. I am hungry. Just start cooking. Let me eat. I beg. Copas. Copas. Adaku. Who is after you? When I went back from school, I saw the dead body of Adobe. Yes. You, you mean Adobe in my class? Yes, Adobe. How? What happened? I don't know. I don't know. Emma, um, what of her parents? Has her parents been informed? Yes, yes. Her mother, she's on her way there now. Yes. What is this now? Something is wrong somewhere. Yes. Something is wrong somewhere. Mike, how did it happen? It was said that her sister went into the forest to answer the call of nature. Coming out, she found her sister's dead body on the ground. Hey, hi. Wonder shall never end in this village. This story is very strange. I'm scared. My father said this is the first time such death is being recorded in this village. Your father is one of the four lawmakers of this village. What are they planning to do about these deaths? Mm. He said that the others will have a meeting tomorrow to know the way forward. May we save Ruwa and our chief save us from these deaths. He said, Ujuma, let's go. I want to go and visit the new copper this evening. Mbeke. Mm -hmm. So you're still interested in this copper? Why not? 
My boyfriend Chibuzo is so arrogant. And he's even saying he's not the father of my child. So I don't want him again. Acharazim. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Elders of our land, the decision makers of our land. You are all aware of what happened. Where one of our daughter's body was found along the road that she was coming back from school. It's a very bad one. And we should do something about it. But the question is now, what do we do? Because if nothing is being done about this, I'm afraid. I believe that the solution is here with us. I believe him. Ikuku, the chief priest of Ubu, is here with us. So that we know what to do and what happened to our daughter. That is what I have in mind. Naniku, you know the villagers are looking on to us as the lawmakers of this community. Yes. And we must have to find the problems and they know how to tackle it. And I thought as much that we will sit first and take a decision before I should go to Alpha. Eh? Oh, <coughs> yeah. Um. My elders, if I may suggest, tomorrow is a case uh, back in day. Uh, uh, yes. uh, let's all assemble here. Ka Ikuku, the chief priest. Not only Ruanyaba, Wanabava. So that we will know the true way to follow and what to do. I agree to that. That is what we must do. We all have to go back home. Come back here tomorrow so that Ikuku will tell us the words of the gods. The gods of our land will guide us. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, the gods will guide us. Yes, You're welcome, uh, Ngbeke, Thank you. Um, I came to gift you some fruits. <laughs> wow. Oranges. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. you something. Um, okay. I like you and I want you to be my boyfriend. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Leave that excuse me. 
I promise to give it to you back and front every day, hot, hot. The way I used to give it to my ex boyfriend, Chibuzo. We used to do it everywhere, huh? be it in the bush, on the road, even inside the water. Excuse me. <laughs> All that same excuse me. That was what he said to me the very first day he toasted me. He said, excuse me, fine gear. And I gave it to him. Hot, hot. That same day. <laughs> See, we used to do it everywhere. Sometimes I used to be on top. <laughs> Sometimes we used to do it in his house, even when his father is around. He won't even know that something is happening. Don't worry. I promise to give it to you every day. <laughs> I got like here now. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Give me what exactly? I not seen these two oranges. <laughs> I got like here. Bye bye. Hey, Who is she and what is she doing here? <laughs> <laughs> Abigail, you will believe what, what happened right now. Sit down. What happened? <laughs> not even Musa no go see for it. Tell me now. In fact, not even Richard no go see for this village. Can you talk to me? <laughs> I'll tell you, I'll tell you. I was just here, lying down by myself by myself, taking my fine pictures. This girl from nowhere. Now, 
I stop at his house while coming. And he told me that he's behind me, that I should be going. Then what is keeping him? <sighs> well, let's give him some time. Hmm? Maybe he is consulting the gods. That's true. Maybe. That's true. Because the things of the gods are not the things of humans. Exactly. Let's give him some time. Say something now. Who is after you? Talk now. Who is after you? My Say something now. My elders, on my way to the market, I saw Ezi Kuku lying dead on the road. Ezi Kuku. Abomination. Abomination. Power. Power. Go and show us. Come on, show us. <clears throat> So in that dream, I was just inside this, inside here, this mm -hmm. our house here, mm -hmm. and I heard a voice, like somebody crying. What happened? I came outside. I, I came to see who was behind the voice from here, and I saw a girl. I saw a girl sit, sitting down here, the same place. <laughs> Yes, yeah, this same piece I'm sitting down right now. The girl was sitting down here, wearing our khaki uniform, seven over ten complete, crying. And I, I don't know. I was just, I was surprised because at first I thought, I thought it was you. Then I, I, I approached her from here to ask her. I asked her, "Who are you?" And I woke up. From there, Sha. I don't know what happened to me. I just woke up. She did not say anything. I can't remember if she said anything or not. I just, I get, I just woke up. Oh, <sighs> she there was telling you, but you doubted. Now you see it with your own eyes. I swear. When I was telling you, you thought I was joking. Mm -hmm. um, I see. We need to ask questions. So, we need to ask questions. I believe some couples have visited here before us. You must have some answers. Like, why would we see the same person and the same girl in our dreams? Yeah, but you need to ask questions. Madam, why is the girl all empty? Where is the water you went to fetch? Coppers, something terrible has happened. What is it? What happened again? What again? Is a cuckoo is dead. Is it cuckoo? Yes, his body was found on the road. Some hours ago, and now you are hungry. Yeah, you can want your need new. Eh? It's okay. Later, we'll prepare roasted yam and the uh, okbaka. Mama! 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 The worst has happened. What? What happened? You people will give me high BP. What is it? Mama. What is it? On my way coming back to the house, uh -huh. I saw the villagers gathered. Uh -huh. So I said I should go and check what was happening. Mm. So I saw Ezekuku lying down dead. Ezekuku? It's a lie. Ma, will I be lying to you? Wait, oh, wait, oh. You mean you saw Ezekuku, the village elder, lying dead on the floor with your two eyes? Mama, as big as I am, will I be lying to you? I'm not lying now, mm. Mama. Ah, ah. Abomination. Ah, no. Wait, Obina. 
Something is wrong in this our village. God forgive it. I don't have to die. Yo. No, no, no. Something is wrong. Something is wrong. Hey, Chimo. First, it was my daughter Adobe. Now, Ezekiel. Hey, please. What is happening? Something is happening. Coppers are behind this killing. Hey! Cheluko Kamia. Cheluko Kalu. Cheluko Kamia. Now, only a bolo consa has so. That's a little bubu. Hey! You mean to tell us that those coppers are the ones that killed Ezekuko? Hey! The oldest man in this community. Hey! Hmm. They must not escape this. We must kill them all. Yes. We, we must, must kill, kill them, them all. Okay. 
Both of you are responsible for the dead in our village. Yes. yes. No. And both of you killed Ezekuko. Yes. yes. No, 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 no. Both of you must be buried alive. Present when the elders gave the instruction that they be buried alive. Hi, my own Richard, buried alive. But how are the elders so sure that they are the ones behind the death of Ezekiel? The words of Ezekiel can never be false. I heard she speaks the truth and nothing but the truth. Before our elders got her to come to the village and talk, a big cow was sacrificed to a dead Millie. So she can't tell a lie. She's too pure to tell a lie. <sighs> I loved Richard so much. He was so cute. But I never got the chance to kiss his lips before his death. <laughs> Mbeke. Mbeke. You can never change. Well, now that Richard is dead, I will advise you to go back to the father of your child. Who? Chibuzo, of course. Who else? <sighs> Ezekiel is dead, and soon he will become the next Ezekiel. And this whole village will be on, under his control. And. All the fowls and the hen sacrificed to the gods will be his food. I can never be hungry with my child once I become his wife. I think I'll go back to him. <laughs> he joking. <laughs> uh, you are funny. I'll be on my way now. Okay. Let me escort you.
bien guéri. On bien guéri. On bien guéri. On bien guéri. On bien guéri. I don't think there is any reason for us to visit Ezenwai once more. To seek out the problems we are facing in this village. Or do you both have enough money to buy another cow for Idemiri before the Ezenwai arrives? Amuche, what do you want us to do? It's you okay, K is dead. Me okay, I'm not ready to die. I'm not ready to die. Even if it, it requires me selling my land to get cow for a dead I will do it. <sighs> my son, is there any place we can find solution for this our problem? Talk to us, because I don't understand. <laughs> My elders, I know of a very powerful man of God residing in Uruagu. And I am very, very convinced that once we visit him, he will not only pray for us, but he will also discover the problems we are facing in this village. And not just the problems, but the solutions to the problems we are facing in this village. You say a very powerful man of God. How sure are you about this powerful man of God? And how sure are you that once you will meet him, our problems will be over? Ichio Kafo. I am very, very convinced. And as a matter of fact, I can even take you to him right away. Ichio Kafo. There is no time. Let's go. Where am I even going to? Okay. Yeah, you sure will be now, be at home now. Anyway, let me go and check. Mom. 
Morgana, please, please. Hey, please, Morgana, please, please don't, don't. Oh. 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 Pastor, you see, with all this we have told you right now, you could see the reason we need your help in this situation. We really need your help. Please help us. Pastor, we don't want any more death in our village. We have been living in fear. Pastor, please do anything you can to help us from this problem. Please, I beg of you. Hmm. My son. You can't go now, Mom. Mili edu gwa wawon. Anya maro zye ba yi bo yide. Oba yi de ba kan ni. Oba yi de ba ke be. We are confused. Please. Help us. Please, please go. I feel there is a problem somewhere. But I'm yet to connect to it. But as people say, there is no smoke without fire. Need and let us pray. In Jesus' name. Amen. In the most holy name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Jehovah, we thank your holy name. For you have brought your people, O oh Lord, to come to your presence and seek for solution on what is happening upon their land. Yes, Father God Almighty, may they find you here in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, may you repeat to us, O oh Lord, what has been happening in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, King of glory, in the... Sit down. Um, Pastor, you really look very bothered. Yes. This was the problem. They were here as soon as we started praying. They were here. Who are they, please? And now they are gone. Yeah. It's a long story, but I'll tell you all about it. It all started two years ago, when the first visitor came to your village, who was sent by the government. And there was this young man, Chibozo, the son of Ezekuku, who started making advances at her. Chibuzo, how are you doing? I'm fine, Papa. And how is your father, Ezekuku? 
Yeah. Copper, can I sit first? Yeah, sure. You can sit. Okay, thank you. Mm. My father is my father is fine. He's doing well. Okay. Um this one you came to visit me this afternoon. I hope all is well. <laughs> Copper, all is well. See, I I came to tell you something very important. Yeah. This one is personal. My father or my father has nothing to do with this. Okay. I, I wanted to tell you that um, from the first day you stepped your feet into this village, I, I've always had my eyes on you. Yes, I, I've always had my eyes on, on you. I, I admire you a lot. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. Copper, you don't understand. I, I have feelings for you. I want you to be my girlfriend so that both of us can be doing one or two. You should understand now. Chibuzo, I respect you a lot because you're one of the educated boys in this village. And also for the fact that your father is a chief. But I, I am not interested in your proposal of being girlfriend or relationship or whatever. Okay? I will be at the back of my house. When you're done, you, you can find your way out. No problem. I'll try again next time. I've been waiting for you since morning now. You wasted time today. I know you always pass through this part every morning when going to school. So I decided to wait for you here. So And who is your love? I have told you time to tell number. I am not interested. My name is Morgana. Stop this thing now. Stop this thing now. You know I have feelings for you. Very strong feelings. Just give me an opportunity to prove my love to you. See. I promise I'll make sure your stay in this village is very comfortable. I'll provide everything that you need. Hey, Chibuzo. Chibuzo. This should be the last time you ever stop me on the road and say this rubbish. Excuse me. No, Ahala. But I bet you, the next time we meet, I will not take it so easy on you. I warned you. That's the problem with you, these girls. You, you think you are smart. This thing would have been easy for both of us. Eh? But now look at it. You could not even survive while I was even doing the thing. You cannot even stand. What do I do now? Okay, I came prepared. Let me just dig, dig a shallow grave and bury your body. Let me just dig a shallow and bury your body.
buried her body and gave a false report to his father. I want to see my friend Obin now. Uh, 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 Papa, um, that reminds me, I, I saw that copper, Morgana. I saw her entering a boat, leaving this village. I, I asked her, I, I asked her what the problem is, but she did not tell me anything. Did she complain of anything? She did, not, she did not tell me anything, Papa. Um, but uh, Papa, she was carrying a small bag, so I think she might come back. Ah. Mm. Okay. Ah. Mm. Okay. 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 Go get me water to drink. Okay, Papa. Okay. Morgana is a very stubborn and wicked spirit. When she was alive, she was a girl that came from the waters, which we call Obanje. Upon her death, she swore to kill whoever she likes, just to avenge for her own death. Hi! Pastor, so you mean to tell us that Chibuzo, the son of Eziku, has been the cause of all this happening in our village. This is unbelievable. Hey, my son. We the villagers, I can remember. We went to Esawan, yes, if I'm not mistaken, to ask for the problem in our village and seek for solution. We all know that this why it doesn't lie. Yes. And it doesn't deceive. So why did this why lie to us? Yes, Pastor. Why did she lie to us? She did not lie to you. She said the person that killed Ezekuku was a visitor sent to your village by the government, which was Morgana. Hey! But you were in a hurry to think and believe it was the current two coppers serving. And you went ahead to bury the two of them alive. Hey! Thinking they were the ones that killed Ezekuku. Hey! And now, the spirits of the three coppers are all over your village, killing and causing more harm to your people. Hey! Hello, Pastor. The deed has been done. Yes. And the harm has already been caused. So what you all need to know now is what is the way forward? What do we do? What do we do about this? What do we do? Talk to us. I will pray and ask for God's mercy. And I will tell you what to do next. Pastor, the problem now is that we are afraid of going back home. I don't want to die, Pastor. Even me. You must have to help us. Going back home is not the solution here. I... Nobody knows who, who is next to die. Please, Pastor, help us. You don't have to be afraid of anything. 
Don't worry about anything. I'll pray about it. And tomorrow, I'll come to your village and give you solutions. Abomination. Let us pray. In Jesus' name. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Father, I thank you, ancient of days. For you have revealed to us, O oh Lord, what has been happening in the land of your people who have come to seek for their presence. Father, we thank you, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father, we seek for the solution on what to do about these things happening in their land. Father, O oh Lord, reveal to us what we shall do, and we shall do it, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' most holy name we pray. Amen. are growing wings day by day. Yesterday before we could get back home, Chibuzo was already dead. Yes. The wages of sin is dead. Wages of sins? Pastor. They are still killing our people. I don't understand. What is going on? Tell us, talk to us. Pastor, what is it? Pastor, 
at this point in time, we really need your help. <laughs> Yesterday, when I was praying, they appeared in my prayers. And I was asking them for forgiveness. After a long time, they accepted. But with one condition. One condition. Hmm. Omori Fanya Floban May. Talk to us. What is the condition? The condition is that their bodies must be assumed and be taken to their respective homes to be given proper burial. With that, their souls will rest in peace. Pastor, that is a very difficult task. But if that will make them to stop killing our people, we have no option. We will do it. Um, I think I'll have to take their bodies to the local government. Maybe from there we can locate their different families. You're correct. Huh. At this point, we have to gather the youth yes. to dig out their remains. Hmm? That is the only way. <laughs> 